Hello, everyone. Good evening. Hello, hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, everybody. Good evening, everybody. How are you today? How was your day? Tell me. What did you do? Working. <laughs> okay, sounds like a very interesting day. <laughs> Marco, how do you feel? Are you tired? Christina, how are you? Hi, teacher. Hello. How are you? I'm fine. Okay. Thank you, teacher. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you. And you? I'm okay. Yeah, I'm good. <laughs> yes, try to be positive, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, it's time. It's time to start. So I'm going to take your attendance. Um, let's see. Today is. Who can tell me what day is today? What day is it today? September 27, 2022. Excellent, very good. 20, 21. Okay. 2021. So, okay. Yeah, thank so you. it's <laughs> no, thank you. Okay, so today is um, Monday, September 27th, and the year 2021. Okay. So let's see, Monday, I'm going to start with Miss Vides Castillo, Alba Dinora. Present. Okay, Alexander Rodas. Present teacher. Very good. Just let me do something here. Okay. What about Mr. Cañengues? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, Mr. Cañengues. Um, Carlos Walberto Rodriguez. Cristina. Okay. Oh, you're there. Cristina Romero. Listen. Thank you. Domingo González. Present teacher. Fátima Portillo de Hernández. Ok, no yet. José Matías Lemus Ramírez. Present. Marco Velázquez. Present teacher. Marlon Cardona. Mauricio Mahano, Maideli Judith Diaz. Okay, she is oyente present. Nancy Rodriguez, Rocío Martinez. Present teacher. Okay, wow, you're here. Uh, Salvador Escobar. Present teacher. And Sandra Velázquez. Present. Victor Salazar. Present teacher. Walter Daniel González. William Eduardo Pérez. Jasmine Melanie Lemos. Okay. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. Okay, class, so this is our video conference number eight. 
Yes. Almost the middle of the course. And today, guys, um, the topic for today's class is how to use make and might. That's the topic, okay? And um, can you see now my, my, my screen? Yes, yes. Good. So we can see here the class objective. Matias, would you like to read the class objective, please? Um, class number eight, uh, how to use may and mine. Uh, class objective. Participants will be able about to prepare a short conversation in which they are showing dissatisfaction about a uh, they received or bought in a uh, hypothetic, hypoth hypothetical, hypothetical. hypothetical conversation. Thank you, Matthias. Yes. So, um, well, you have at the end of the class, uh, you have to be able to talk about a, a product that you received, but then you are not satisfied with. You have uh, some pro, I mean, you don't like the product, you are not satisfied with the product, okay? So let's see the activities. We have the warm up practice of getting cut, which is the topic of the last class, last Friday. Then in activity one, we have the role play. If you remember last, Last class, uh, you prepared one with your with your partner, and today you are going to present it. Activity two: online orders and perform. Then we have listening practice, and finally the wrap up, in which you are going to create the conversation and present it. So let's start with the warm up. Okay, in this warm up, we have. It says you have to change the sentences, I'm sorry, so that they include can or could. For example, if it's a polite request and it says, I want to have some coffee, how will you make it a, a polite request? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna make this example, okay? Just let me do something here. Okay, so oh. we have we have this. I want to have some coffee. So if you want to make it a polite request. You have to use could. Oh. Would I have some coffee? Okay. Yeah, would I have some coffee? Mm -hmm. Sure. Yes. Yeah. Y ahí diría alguna taza de café o algún café. Algo de café. I will, I will, could I have some coffee? Podría tener a café, algo de café. Cup coffee. Mm -hmm. Or you can say, could I have a cup of coffee? Mm -hmm. okay. okay, what about the number two? There is another, if you want to make it a polite request, it says, I want to sit here. How would it be a polite request? Can you please do it? In your notebook or in the chat, can you share, please? If, if I said, instead of saying, I want to sit here, how can you change that? Would or I, I want to sit her. Uh -huh. And you change using can or could? Could I? Could I sit here? Mm -hmm. 
Okay, mm -hmm. now number three. I want to stay with you. For I to stay with you. Could I stay with you? Could I stay with you? Okay. Could I stay, Could I with, stay you? with you? Exactly. You don't need to use to. Okay. Could I stay with you? Now, in this one, I want you to pick up the children. I want you to pick up the children. If it can, can I? Can I? Very good, because it's important. Pick up the question. children. The can, children. No, can you? Can you? Uh, can you pick up the children? Okay. Nice. Number five, I want you to pick up the children, but this is a polite request. So I'm not going to use can. I'm going to use. Would you to pick up the children? Could you pick Good, up the exactly. Children? Exactly. So it's or going you? to be could you, or you exactly. Pick up the children. Could you pick up the children? Very nice. Very nice, guys. Next, it says, I want you to come over later. It picks up all I request. I will say, For you to come over later. Uh -huh. Could you come over later? Excellent. Could you come over later? Okay, number seven, informal request. I want you to give me a hand. Can you to give can you to help me? me? Okay. Help. Uh -huh. Can you give me a hand? No vamos a usar aquí el Can tú. you give me? Mm. Okay. No le ponemos el tú, okay? Can you give me a hand? Exactly. Can you give me a hand? <laughs> I can give you two. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay, number eight. Informal request. I want you to pass me the salt. Can you pass me the salt? Exactly. Can you pass me the salt, please? Can you pass me the salt? Okay. Number nine, informal request. I want you to come. Ah, it's the same. I want you to come over later. Ah, but it's informal. So it is? Can no you problem. come over later? Can you? Exactly. Can you come over later? And the last one, I want to use your pen. And it's informal request. Can, can, I you, use, can I use your pen? Okay, nice. Very good, very good, guys. Okay, now in the next exercise, in the next exercise, you just have to put can or could. Okay, and it's very easy. Can you please? Um, Copy the 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 um, complete the the complete sentences using can or could please. For example, can I use your car? Could I have some uh, some wine? Can you take care of my cat? Can I have a sandwich? Can you drive me to the airport? Can I have some tea? Please. 
we have the other one. Use your mobile phone, some uh, or an iPad, borrow me some money and some cigarettes. This uh, copy in your notebook, complete and copy in your notebook. Remember, first is can or could, then the subject, and then the complement that is here. You already had it. Okay, we have the first one. It says, uh, Domingo wrote, can I use your car? Can you, did you finish this one, guys? Because I have another couple of exercises in the next slide. Can I move to the next one? No, teacher. Yes, teacher. Give me a moment. Oh, okay. Ready, I take a uh, screenshot. Good. Good. Okay, guys. Now, um, 
I'm going to send you into breakout rooms and I want you to ask and answer the questions, okay? But not only say yes or no, I would like you to uh, practice your speaking abilities, your speaking skills, asking all their questions. They are called follow-up questions or giving more information. So don't limit yourselves uh, by just saying yes, yes, you could, or yes, I can, or yes, you can. I would like you to expand a little bit more and practice your speaking, okay? Are you ready for that? I'm ready. <laughs> okay, so let me see. We have 16 students. I'm going to create, oops, too many. Okay. See you later. There is a, a, a bat <laughs> flying over me. Hello, Domingo. So, Domingo, you're going to ask and answer the questions with Sandra. Sandrita, hello, are you there? Teacher, hoy no mandó lo, los... That, that's right, I didn't send the, 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 the presentation. You are right. I'm gonna I'm gonna send it right now. Okay, just give me one moment. Okay. And let me see if I can send you a corner. I'm gonna send you Marco Ali. Okay. In progress. Hi, hello, teacher. Hi, Marco. Uh, I'm, so, I'm so sorry, <laughs> but can you please work with Domingo because uh, Sandra is oyente. Ah, okay. Please, thank you so much. Okay, don't worry. I appreciate your help. Okay, thanks. Hello, Domingo. Hello, Marco. Domingo looks tired. Wake up, my friend. <laughs> Hola, teacher. Hello, Sandrita. How are you? <laughs> How do you feel? Solo comentarle que estoy un poquito ocupada. Okay, so Marcos. Me, me se ocupe, me, me, me empezaré a comentar ahí. Okay, it's okay. Gracias. You're welcome. Pues sí, Domingo. Empieza. Acabo, acabo de suspender el trabajo que estaba haciendo y estaba soldando y voy llegando. Ok. <laughs> Está bien. Sí. Que, me, que no tengo estrés y... Teacher, hoy no mandó la, la presentación. <laughs> yes, Domingo has just told me that. I'm going to send it right now, but this computer is the interest is low. Just give me one moment. I'm going to send it, okay? Okay. okay. 
Yes, but if you have the screenshots, you can start, I mean, and in your notebook, practice, okay? Ask and answer the questions. Okay, send it the, the screenshot. Yes, this is very slow. Okay. Now. Yo no sé si la había hecho bien la primera hecho. Can I, I use your car? Can I use your car? Okay. Yeah, yeah, of course. Y la otra que logré hacer era, can, can I use a, your mobile phone? Can I use your mobile phone? Okay. Yeah. So you will start, please, start conversations with those ones. So what do you answer to that, Marco? Sorry, teach. How would you answer? If, if Domingo asks, hey, Marco, can I use your car? What will you answer? Uh, can yes. You, can... you, yeah, you can do it my car. Yes, you, you can use my car. You can use, you can use my car. Really? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> eh, no, corríjame bien, teacher. Es que, que en, o que en hay. Can I? Can, can I? Can I? Can I? Can I use your can car? Así sería. Can I? Okay. Can I. Eh, la otra que he hecho. Eh, call you and some I iPhone. Está bien hecha. Can you and some I iPhone? Uh, some. De donde dice can. No. Solo decía some one iPhone, algo así. Iphone era, ¿no? No, era no. Pero no, no, casi no le comprendimos esa, esa parte. Era de completar, creí que le, y hacer las preguntas. I don't know, but I have a problem with this. En la segundo, en la segunda imagen que, man, que puso estaba el script, el script. Can I have some tea? No era esa. Can you have I pin? I pin. I pin. Bueno, no me fijé bien. Can I use your mobile phone? No, you can you can use that because it is Privado, Personal. It's private. It's private. It's private. Uh, it's private. Private. Or, private. or it's personal. Personal um, or pri private. Privado. Right. It's privado. private or it's personal. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's private. No, 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 can you llevarme al aeropuerto, pero Can you take me to the airport? Can you take me to the airport? Exactly. Mm -hmm. you say, yes, no problem. Oh, uh, mm -hmm. sure. Oh, 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 sure. Sure, I, también... sure I take you to the airport. Si sí, puedo llevarte. Exactly. Or you can even say, no, I'm so sorry, but I can't. Entonces ahí sería, I can, I can see. Or, Puedo llevarte. Yes. Oh, so sorry, I, I can, I can do, I can take, no. Take you because, uh, Como estoy ocupado o um, I have busy. Mm -hmm. Si es un taxi, sorry, I have a, a other client. Or, or, tengo otro cliente o, o, o espero otro cliente. I'm waiting for another client. Ah, ok. I'm waiting for another client. 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 Yes. 
Okay, guys. So now I am sending the, the presentation so you can have it. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Of the group you send it? Yes, the WhatsApp group. All right. Okay, okay. Creo que mañana sí. ver bien rojo los ojos. <ríe> yeah. Still ring. <ríe> sí. Ah, ok. Veremos qué, qué pasa. Hello, Entonces, dear students. Ah, okay, continue. Hello, teacher. Es que estábamos. Teacher, I don't know when to use exactly who or can. Uh, for example, in these examples, this, this example, some uh, uh, a T. Where do you give a, a T? Donde pide uno T? En un restaurante difícilmente. Lo hace en su casa o en el trabajo, a lo sumo. Entonces, por allí partíamos de que es como Ken, porque es con alguien conocido, algo informal. Pero en sí no tenemos una, como una, que le digo, una fórmula para saber si es could o, o es Ken. Ok. En Cristina, do you have an answer for that? Eh... Lo que le decía a Milka es que depende de la situación. Así se, se, puede, se usa. Por ejemplo, si está en un restaurante, va a, pedir, va a ser call you. Uh -huh. Pero si está en su casa, can, can you. Porque es como más de conformal. Exacto. Ajá, so that is the difference. Pero si Pero... es válida las dos formas. Yes, both ways, exactly. But uh, could is more polite. Yes. Mm -hmm. It's more polite. And can is less polite, it's more informal. That's mm -hmm. why, uh, as you said, Christina, um, if you are uh, with people you know, yeah, your friends or your family, it's probably that you use can. But with people for you example, don't know, could. Teacher. Yes. For example, uh, uh, who who are who are say uh, can I can I use your cars? A quién le podría decir que me prestar un vehículo, su vehículo? Uh, your your brother, brother, your father. Yes. Pero no a un, a un desconocido o a una persona exactly. que uno... So in that case, you say, can I? I mean, if it's like your friend or your brother. Mm -hmm. Ok. Entonces, por eso, es que can I. I. Uh -huh. Ok, ahora sí ya me queda más claro. Nice. Nice. <laughs> Thank you. You are welcome. That's why that's my 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 job to help you. I'm your facilitator. A rodar en las motos, ni a dar vueltas. Hello, teacher. Hello, my forehead of my teacher. Teacher. Porque por ah es que hay Ya entendí. Es que usted se llama Rocío y estoy con Rocío. Ajá, oh, entonces, yeah. entonces ahí, ahí tenía una, una, una equivocación. Yo dije, ahí está, ahí está la teacher, dije así, pero no está, no ha hablado, qué raro, dije yo. Sí. 
inútil. Hasta sí, Rusia no ha estado contestando sí. la pregunta. No, ve que también está Mauricio. Entonces, pero dice oyente. Entonces yo dije, ah, oyente, solo oyente. Le ha puesto de seguro, se equivoca así como vos, Alfredo. Vos decís oyente y también en tu nombre. Ajá, sí, entonces. No yo, estoy en la casa. Ajá, entonces yo dije, oyente, ah, es ese Rocío. Dije, y de repente leí que decía Rocío, ah, la teacher, dije, y no habla, qué raro, dije. No, it's, it's, it's my twin. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay, guys, how, how are you doing? Are, did you finish? Yes, yes, teacher. teacher. Yes. Okay, but there are some other groups that they are still practicing. Uh, but um, how do you feel with the use of can and could? Um, well, no, it's not, no, it's a difficult, but uh, depend the use. And depends on the situation, right? Because yes. if it's with people, I mean, like your friends or your family, you um, you are more okay. informal, right? And you get, use can. Okay. Yeah. And my work with, is cool, you. Exactly. Cool. But with your colleagues at work or in a restaurant or in a bank or in another place, you use good because you are more polite and you don't know the person. Exactly. Yeah. Nice. So I think it's time to go back to the main session. Okay. Okay. Okay, I think, yeah, almost everyone is here. Hello, Jasmine. Hello, teacher. Very good, guys. Thank you for uh, participating in the activity. Okay. I think that you have become experts using can and could. Thank you so much. Can I have like uh, some examples? For example, let's say, Matias, can you ask Salvador about one? No, <laughs> Matias is going to ask you, Salvador. Okay. Um, <clears throat> uh, can... <laughs> okay. Uh, can you borrow me some money? No, Matias. Okay. I, I can't. <laughs> Why? Don't have money. Because don't have money. <laughs> it's correct. Okay. Well, it depends, right? Because if you need one dollar, yes, I can. <laughs> I can lend you one dollar. Very good. Okay, Jasmine, can you please ask Rocio? Rocío Martínez. Ok. Yo pregunto. Please. Ok. Call, call I use your car? Rocío. Okay, maybe she's, she's, I don't know, maybe she's not there right now. <laughs> okay. Yo, yo, 
Yo lo hice con Carlos, por eso no sé si con él. Ok, haz Carlos. Ask, ask the question again, Jasmine, please. Entonces, ¿qué me pregunte él? Ok, Carlos, ask Jasmine. Well, cualquiera de las que están ahí, teacher. Yes, you, or, or any other one, it's your decision. Could, could you like to eat some a sandwich, Jasmine? Ah, ok. Ok, the question is... X, can I have a sandwich or can I have a, could I have a sandwich or can I have a sandwich? Okay. So you have to use can or could. Para pedir algo. Mm -hmm. Okay. Can you make the question again, Carlos? Okay. Would you son a sandwich? No, es que allí son está, vaya, miren, esta que dice aquí son a, a sandwich es porque usted tiene que elegir cuál de estas es la correcta. Son Por ejemplo, a, a. Ajá, una de esas tres va a elegir, pero antes de eso ah, necesita un ya, verbo. Ajá, sí, entonces sería Could you, could you, could you eat? lie? How could you eat? Mm, you porque like aquí me? Les, yo, le está yo, pidiendo yo hacer algo. Ajá, could you pues, like eh, me? Could you, no, make, you, could you me? make me a sandwich? You make me. Yo le estaba preguntando, sí. could you like to eat a ah, sandwich? Eh, pero esa es, would you, would you like to eat a sandwich? Te gustaría, pero ah, es different. Ah, But yeah, here yeah. is asking for something. Uh -huh. Por ejemplo, <laughs> Jasmine, could you make me a sandwich, please? I am hungry. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. okay. Or, Carlos, are you, going, eh, are you going to the supermarket? Yes, I'm, or are you going to the shopping mall? Can you please buy me a sandwich? Uh -huh. Teacher. Entonces sería, teacher, could you, no, que okay, sería, make. could you like make some a sandwich for me? No, 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 no. Could <laughs> no. you make me? Could you make me? Could you make me a sandwich? A sandwich. Ajá, me podrías hacer un sandwich. Could you make me a sandwich? Could you make me a sandwich? Just me. Uh, yes. Only one, a sandwich de chicken? Yes. I a like chicken that. sandwich? What about a chicken sandwich? Okay. Very, very good. Okay. okay. Es, es a sandwich de chicken or, de, or, or a chicken or, sandwich? A chicken sandwich. Okay. Okay. Gracias. Thank you. Uh -huh. You can say, is a chicken sandwich okay? Yes. That would be nice. So delicious because I'm hungry. <laughs> Okay. Matías, do you have a question? Yes, es que yo puse eh, could you give me a sandwich? Okay, if the person has many sandwiches there, yeah, you can ask if you need one sandwich. Please. Um, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys. Now, I want to ask you if you are ready with your partner to present the conversation to ask about uh, the, the product. Do you remember that you were going to present it today? Don't remember. Now you have amnesia. Yes. Yes. <laughs> now guys, be serious. I mean, for real. Who would like to present a conversation? The one that you created last Friday, asking for a product in a polite way. <laughs> Hello. ¿Quiénes están listos para presentar? 
I don't know. Mr. Cañengues, who was your partner last Friday? Uh, last Friday with Domingo. Okay, Mr. Gonzalez, are you ready? <laughs> Can you pass? Mm -hmm. I tried. We tried, teacher. Hey, Domingo, do you remember uh, that uh, the talk about the, the topic? When do you remember that it full? It pizza, the promotion, super supreme. Do you remember? Yes. Yeah, remember. Uh, okay. um, you are a, uh, are you, are you sailor or are you customer? Do you choose? ¿Quieres ser el vendedor I, o quieres ser el cliente? Cliente. The client. Okay. The client. The client or client. customer. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thanks for calling uh, Amilcar. How can I help you? Uh, hi, Amilcar. Uh, call you. Hi, Mission Information. The proposal. Promotion, the you pizza? Oh yeah, of course. Uh, with pleasure, Mr. Dominguez, we have uh, some promotion for this day. For example, we have you the Super Supreme. What take is more meat and more ham, etc. Also the big color. Uh... And repeat uh, promos, the promos, uh, the Super Suprema? Yes, Super Supreme. Uh, what they is more meat and more ham and pepperoni too. Also, uh, the, the big cola, it's, it's, a, it's a combo. I you like I I you like the order it is a combo. Okay. Um thank you for calling. Very That's nice. Okay. Thank you so much. Congratulations. Please everybody clap. Mm -hmm. clap for, for the students for your classmates. <laughs> okay, thank you so much. Okay. Um yeah, they were good ideas. Maybe we need to work on some pronunciation things, but it, overall it was good. Okay, uh, let's see. Mr. Velasquez, I saw you like very worried or tired. Would you like to have some adrenaline and, <laughs> and perform your conversation? Uh, I'm very tired, but. Uh, bueno, voy a intentar. Yes, este, try uh, it. The adrenaline is going to help you. With Fatima and Gualberto, but we don't finish the, the homework. Or maybe you can improvise. Sorry? You can also improvise. Fatima, hello. Hello, Adrian. Hello. Everybody, hello, teacher. <laughs> okay, <laughs> Fatima. Um, are you ready? Because Marco is ready. He needs some adrenaline mm -hmm. to wake up. I'm not ready, but I can try. <laughs> okay, yes, I know you can. You and Marco can do it. We make... Um, I'm Walberto you know? too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We make shirt and fleece pants. Okay. Like, 
I will be the the client, and you client. you will be the all right the seller. Okay. Hi, I I would like to make an order of shirts and pants. Okay. Can Good you... evening. I am Marco. Um, what is your name? For the My name is Fatima. Fatima. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Thanks for calling. We made a uh, shirt uh, brand Nike and a fleece. Thanks, Nike too. And shirts too, Under Armour. Oh. Uh, nice. I tell you the uh, uh, finish, uh -oh. teacher. Teacher, we have finished. Finish. Now you have to repeat. <laughs> 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 no, just kidding. Um, yeah. I, I'm uh, not the internet. Yeah, no, we, we are kidding we too, teacher. We we didn't finish. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, go ahead, Fatima. Okay, can I have the price of the chart? All right. Uh, the chart basic is the twenty-four dollars. The okay, twenty-four dollars. Excess, excess small and medium. Okay, the, what, yeah. What about the pants? The pants, please. All right, these pants. It's very nice because is you it have it has comfort and the price is fifty 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 dollars. Okay, I think it's very expensive. Yeah. But, but it's very calidad teacher. High good quality. quality. High quality. It's yeah. a good quality. Okay. If, I would like to if you need more I information, like I send it with my co-worker, Carlo Gualberto, if you can ask a okay. question for for her. For Alberto, I would like to know if I have to order a minimal quantity or I can buy only one unit. Sorry, for Alberto or for me? Alberto. <laughs> Alberto. Okay. <laughs> you can answer that. Hi, nice, nice to meet you. Hi, Fatima. Carlos. Nice to meet you too. Could you repeat the, the question, please? Yes, I I would like to know if I have to order the minimum. If you buy, if you sell only, if you sell by unit, or I have to order a a minimal order quantity. Uh, uh, wherever you want piece of. Or pound or, or whatever unit you want. Okay. Good to, good to know that. So, and then I would like to order one chart. Uh, I would like to get the chart basic size and one pants, also in a basic size. Uh, can you send the product to? to my house? Yes, we we can send to your house. And okay. if, if do I have to pay for, for the shipment or it is free? Um, for the shipment. But free of churn or I have to pay for the shipment? <laughs> Tengo que pagar por el envío yes, o me lo van a dar gratis. <laughs> <laughs> free of charm. Okay. Oh, it, it's free, it's free. It's free. The, okay, the same is free. Eh, can I yeah, know the yeah. total amount of my my purchase? The total amount. I need yeah. to buy a chart and a pants. Can I know the total amount? Monto total. 
total amount, amount that I have to pay. How many you need? You need How many you need? units? You Only need? one, one shirt and one pants. Only one, all right. Yep. Only uh, one. Okay, thanks, Kai, for your $74. Okay, okay. <laughs> thank you. Thank you for your, for your help. Okay. okay we send, <laughs> we send your, we send <laughs> your product, <laughs> your product in a week. Sí, pero si sí sabes lo que están vendiendo, ¿verdad? <laughs> Uh, yeah, of course. Uh, we, we know. We, yes. <laughs> they know. <laughs> okay. Thank you so much. Again, good job. Okay. Good job. Thank, Thank you. Okay. Um, who else? Who else would like to try? Cristina, who was your corner? Ya no terminé la clase el viernes, teacher. Mm, okay. Okay, guys, it's okay. So, um, thank you for the ones who participated. I'm sorry, Monica. La lista. Yes, I was going to, to do that right now. Thank you for reminding me. Okay, so let's see who's here. Alba Dinora. Present. Alfredo Rodas. Present, teacher. Amilcar Cañengues. Present. Carlos Gualberto. Present, teacher. Cristina Romero. Present. Domingo Alexander. Present, teacher. Fatima Portillo. Present. José Matías. Present. Marco David. Present teacher. Mauricio Majano. Present teacher. Maideli Yudin. Nancy Lisset. Rocío Martínez. Present teacher. Salvador Escobar. Present teacher. Sandra Velázquez. Present teacher. Víctor Salazar. Present. Walter Daniel González. William Pérez. Present. Hey, Melanie. Present. Okay. Very good. Thank you. Okay, hey guys, let's continue with the rest of the class. Okay, so we already finished with can and could. So now, guys, we're going to learn about the use may and might. Mm -hmm. So here, to start with this topic, we have here a sorbet about a customer's experience with a product. Uh, <clears throat> so think about, think about the last time you bought something, the last time you purchased a product. How was your experience? Was it a satisfying experience or dissatisfying experience and why? Can you please give me your opinion? Remember participation helps you uh, practice and learn more. So how was your last experience buying a product? Was it good or bad? Satisfying or not satisfying? Yeah, teacher. Okay. Uh, satisfy. Uh, it was satisfying. Uh -huh. But tell me about it. What did you buy? Why uh, were you satisfied with the product, etc.? 
a few months uh, sent me this uh, notebook uh, from USA to El Salvador and good service, the mail. And and llenar, ¿cómo se dice? Feel. Feel. Answer the encuesta. Serving. Uh -huh. I, I, I make the survey and uh, the four point of here are in there. Satisfy uh, or excellent, good, the value of rate, opinion about the product, quality or everything. Okay, thank you, Marco, for your uh, for sharing your opinion. Okay, so think about your, the product. It, look at this summer. Look at this customer's experience with a product. Uh, he was asked, "How satisfied are you with this product?" And he said, "Dissatisfied." Dissatisfied. So that is a big problem. Number two. Rate your opinion about the product's quality. Really? We have the options. High quality, mm -hmm. average, low quality, and very average. low quality. Average for me, teacher, according to my case. Okay, and what did you buy? What product did you buy? Ah, okay. Uh, around to uh, four months, I bought, I bought uh, shoes. Okay, you bought a pair of shoes. Yes. And the, the product's quality was average. Uh, the quality is average. Okay, because high quality is good, good quality, excellent quality. Average yes. is normal, normal. normal. Low quality is not so good, and very low quality is that it didn't work at all. Uh, normal quality, according to the price. Okay. No, the value of the product is excellent, good, poor, or very poor? Mm, good. Okay, in this case, I mean, it's poor, right? In the, in the, in the example. Will you continue okay. using the product? Yes. Okay, very good. So now, guys, here we have... Um, you have to answer these questions. Can you please answer the questions in your notebook? How was the customer's experience? Is the product a good one or a bad one? Think about possible problems the customer had with the product. So according to the survey, you are going to complete the chart. Okay? Do you want to do it in a small rooms or as a class? In a class. In the class. A class. Oh, class. Okay. okay.
Okay. Um, can you tell me, how, according to the survey, how was the customer's experience? Was it good, bad, satisfying, or dissatisfying? Satisfying or dissatisfying? How was the customer's experience with this product? Was it satisfying or dissatisfying? Teacher, it was it satisfying. satisfying. Exactly, dissatisfying. Uh, yes, Mr. Amirkan? <laughs> okay, you put say it was satisfying my need. As to customer, I satisfied. Okay, but this is the questions are about this, this example. Okay, the, the, the sorbi. Aquí están, miren, no sé si las logran ver. Se las preguntan, las van a contestar de acuerdo a esto. So, how was the customer's experience? It was, it was bad because he was dissatisfied, dissatisfied with the product. Dissatisfied. Dissatisfied. Yes, everybody please repeat after me. Very satisfied. Very satisfied. 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 Dissatisfied. 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 Very dissatisfied. Very dissatisfied. Okay. High, now this one. High quality. High quality. Average. Average. Low quality. Low quality. Very low quality. Very low quality. Now, the value of the pro, this you know, right? Excellent. 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 Good. Good. Poor. 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 Very poor. Very, very, very poor. poor. Yes, no. Yes, no. Yes, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> that was just playing with you. Okay, so the second question sir, says here, um, is the product a good one or a bad one? Is the product a good one or a bad one? Bad one. Bad one. Bad one. A bad one. Okay, it's a bad one. Think about possible problems the customer had with the product. What could be some of the problems that the customer had? Quality. Okay, the quality. Maybe, maybe the, the the product got broken or didn't function. Maybe the warranty. Warranty oh. is bad. Okay, maybe the product didn't have a warranty. Because the product has no warranty and it goes bad fast. Can you repeat, Matias? Uh, uh, because the product has no quarantine mm -hmm. and it gets bad fast. Mm -hmm. Okay. Very not rapid. The function. <laughs> the battery life, bad maybe. Fast. For quality products. It's not functional, teacher. Product, maybe, maybe the in, materials. In back, product. product in bad condition. In bad conditions, exactly. Very good. Maybe it was made in China. <laughs> yes. It was made in China. <laughs> okay. Okay, now, now look at this. How to use may and might. 
Okay, so here we have these examples with me, okay? Oops. I'm gonna read examples for you. I may ask for a refund. You may buy at a different store. They may not provide a good service. It may not reach your expectations. Mm, and that happens to me very often with food when I go to a restaurant. Might. <coughs> she might want a refund on those units. They might complain about the service. We might ask to talk with the supervisor. He might not buy here again. So what do you think is the function of may and might? So when do we use it? Any idea? Para pedir. Mm, no, for that we use could and can. But in this case, similar, it's similar for use shoe. No, shoe is the very end. It's, uh, it's like a suggestion, but no, not really. Teacher, in we use may could be like um, when we ask a, like a favor or something, or when we request. Because yeah, something. when you when like in a permission. My, mm -hmm. Yeah, in my I think we use like an obligation could be. Or okay, or you have the idea. You be. have the idea. I'm gonna I'm gonna tell you in the next slide. May versus might. May okay. May is used in many different situations to get permission, to ask for permission, and to talk about a possible situation. So it's about possible situation. For example, if, if I am not satisfied with the product, exactly, very good, my recommendations maybe, uh -huh. If I'm not satisfied with the product, I may ask for a refund. Voy a, yo pediría o podría pedir reembolso. un reembolso, exactly. Uh, I may buy it at a different store. I, uh -huh. I may not provide a good, provide a, a good service. Diferente. Maybe the product may not reach my expectations. Okay, but might is stronger, as it says here. Oops. Something that could happen. Look at this other. Look at this other information. May is in might. They are used for possibility. It might rain later, so take an umbrella to get permission. You may have another cookie if you like. To ask for permission, may I borrow your pen, please? Teacher, may I go to the bathroom? Also, to express wish. May the new year bring you happiness. May God bless you, for example. Que Dios te bendiga. May God bless you. May the new year bring you happiness, etc. Speculate about past actions she is late she may have missed her plane so it's in this case it's about possibility okay possibility in this case that we are using it may or might may and might can normally be interchanged without a significant difference in meaning casi es igual es, el, el, la diferencia es muy muy pequeña However, might often implies a smaller chance of something happening when expressing a possibility. So it may rain 70% chance and it might rain 40% of chance. When expressing wishes or giving permission, only may is used. So, might is like 40% of probabilities to happen. And may is 70% that something is going to happen. Okay? 
¿Sí? Si llega a 50%, chucha. Display mm -hmm. or mine. So, me, both of them are used to talk about possibilities or probabilities. You can take notes of that. Possibilities or probabilities. Mm -hmm. Now, it's time to practice. <laughs> uh -huh, yes, me, what are you doing? Okay, so we have here, may and might are used to talk about the possibility of something happening. May is often more possible than might. Examples, I'm not sure what to do. I may watch TV. You might not like that program, like TV program. Bueno, entonces lo usamos para hablar de la posibilidad de que algo va a suceder, pero ¿cuál es más probable? ¿Cuál se usa cuando hay más probabilidad de que algo pase? Uso may. O uso might. May. May. No. Cuando may. algo es más seguro que va a pasar. May. Uso may. may. Ajá. May. Y might es como menos, menos posibilidad. ¿Ok? And I have okay, these yes. examples here. I have these examples here. Look at this one. There are some dark clouds in the sky. Veo, I am looking at the dark clouds. Veo las nubes grises, oscuras. Entonces, eh, I, I say it may rain. Puede que llueva. Uh -huh. Ahora dice aquí, mire. It's 9.30 and Jack feels tired. He... My tired. ¿Qué Feel es probable que él haga? Son las nueve y media y Jack se siente cansado. ¿Qué es probable que haga? Se duerma. Sleep. Okay. I may sleep. I may sleep. I may relax. He may go to bed. Uh -huh. He might Except relax. He might relax. Okay. My class starts soon. But I'm not sure where the classroom is. Is sería my not. I may not to no, no vamos a usar el to después. Ok, ok. I may not. Present. Assistant. I might not sure where they classroom. No. Ok, you can say. I may not to present. I may class. I may not get there on time. Podría ser porque dice, ya va a comenzar mis clases, pero no estoy seguro dónde está el salón. I may not get there on time. Puede que no llegue a tiempo. Ok. Uh, sé que ahí tenemos que referir de acuerdo a la oración a la posibilidad que podemos exactly. tener. Exactly. So think about the possibility. The, possi uh -huh. the possible situation that can happen. Por eso es, uh, las posibilidades más altas serían me. May. 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 Así como el mes de mayo, May. ¿Ok? May. Esas son las más altas y las la posibilidades más bajas serían Might. Mm. Might. 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 Ok. If you want, guys, you can give me the, 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 your ideas on the chat. Sara has some money and she is at a clothing store.
Sara Mar... she may she may buy uh, uh the shear in the cloning store. Okay, she might buy some clouds. Okay. Yeah. It's a probability. Okay. okay. She might buy a pair of jeans. Fíjense que jeans es plural, lo, lo toman como plural porque como el jeans has two legs. Tiene mm -hmm. dos, dos, dos piernas. Mm -hmm. Entonces, we Entonces, say a pair, some jeans. a pair of jeans mm -hmm. or some jeans. Mm -hmm. Okay, Kelly and Jenny are friends by they live in different cities. They are both traveling to Washington this summer. They may to meeting. They may meet. They may meet. Okay. The, this, okay. After an modal verbs, después de, un, de uno de esos, o sea, may and might are modal verbs. And after modal verbs, we use the verb in infinitive form or base form. Okay. Uh -huh. right. No le ponemos el tú ni el ing. They may meet. I need. Y eso Maybe aplica meet. también con el can, teacher, en una oración. También con el que no, no le ponemos el tú ni el ing. Ok. Number six. It's cold outside, but James isn't wearing a jacket. He may, he may, may, he may. He may freeze. Or eat. He may. He may feel uh, cold. A, a, a cold. I get in the same moment. Sorry. Okay, so it's called outside, but James, James isn't wearing a jacket. Let's see, the chat says. She might. She might get cold, she very may. good. Uh -huh. I'm sorry, it closes. Very good, he might not. Don't sleep, teacher. I'm sorry? Don't sleep in. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'm very tired today. Okay, it's called outside by James Eason wearing a jacket. So the it, Fatima says he may be cold. He might be cold. Number seven, my brother is, vamos a ver, lo voy a poner a leer a ustedes mejor. Eh, Matías, can you read number seven, please? My brother. Oh, perdón, estaba hablando y no tenía activado nada. <laughs> ok. My brother is at the restaurant and he feels a little hungry. Okay, so he feels a little hungry. She Where may. She may. I feel. Brother. We. 
Brother. Brother. He, he, uh, he. he may eat something. He may order some food. Uh huh. He may. She he may, may eat something. He may. She may. He may order a lot of food. Because when I'm hungry and I go to a restaurant, I want to eat a lot. <laughs> okay, the last one. Uh, Carlos, can you read number eight, please? I should go to work today, but I feel a little sick. Okay. Probability. It's an I, I may not to leave uh, to go to go to a work. No, no, no. I may I may not work today. But to okay. Work. Yes. I may not go. No sería you. No, porque estamos hablando de I. About me. Okay, Marlon says, I might not work until I feel okay. I like that idea, especially now with COVID-19, COVID COVID if you feel a little sick, don't go to work. I might not work today. I may not go until I feel better. Hmm. Okay. So how do you feel with these exercises? Easy, right? A piece of cake. Okay, work on the next exercise, please. Create sentences using the words provided a may or might. And write a compliment when it is necessary. Okay, let's work on this, please. Okay, guys, do you have some ideas? Yes. Yes. For example. He may not be satisfied. Okay, he may not be satisfied with the product. Excellent. Oh, we have a lot of ideas in the chat. It says, mm, he might not be satisfied, he might not. Okay, Marlon, no le vamos a poner el tú, solo el might y el verbo, o el might, el negativo y el verbo.
so the number one is we have more more examples he might not be satisfied okay teacher thanks <laughs> you're welcome Marco. okay one two He may not be sad, satisfied. Okay, number two. The warranty month. It may be longer. Longer. May not be longer. Okay, longer, number longer. three. The service may, the service may not, not be, be excellent. May not be excellent, that okay. Very good. Number four. You might not recommend that product. You may not recommend that product to anybody, okay? Or to nobody. Mm -hmm. Number five. The waiter. El mesero. The waiter. The waiter. May be in a hurry. May be in a hurry. Puede que ande a la carrera. May be in a hurry. And the last one. Amanda. Amanda might not use. Excellent. May not Very use. good. Nice. I like it. Good. Did you finish, guys, with all of them? Yes. Yes, it's true. Okay. Now, the next activity. It's your turn, conversation practice. You are going to create a conversation where you are dissatisfied with a product, you're angry about a product, and say what you may or might do about it. So you maybe you can tell a member of your family, a friend, etc., about a product. So You are going to say that, and also you're going to say what you may do about it or what you might do about it. What do you usually do when you are dissatisfied with a product? Do you tell the, the, the owner of the company or the restaurant, do you tell something? Or you just, I mean, don't say anything, but you don't come back to that place, okay? So to talk about these possibilities, uh, you have to create a conversation. I'm going to send you to the breakout rooms and you are going to create the conversations, okay? Okay, yes. it's good. Thank you so much. <sighs> Ah. O es sueño o es ansiedad. O ansiedad por la cama. Oh. Yes, I like that idea.
no es correcto. <laughs> ¿Cómo podemos, cómo puedo mejorar su experiencia? Si vamos a ver. How... How can no. how we can no. how could por qué podemos es podría teacher how podría poner how can. could how could, could. mira ah how sí could I... how could no pero es que de, 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 estás hablando de una empresa y necesitamos el we porque not... están hablando de ellos can you can you make it bigger please Alfredo eh, le, le consultaba que si, si, si pusiera, podría usar ahí, eh, como es la persona que es, a la que estoy llamando, ¿verdad? está en una empresa y me está diciendo, lo siento, siento eso. Eh, ¿Cómo puedo mejorar su experiencia o cómo puedo mejorar eh, eh, que no me gustó el producto? Entonces puedo okay. usar el how could, how could, how could llamado. Uh -huh. En la llamada es que en verdad, dicho. Oh, what can we do to, to improve your experience? ¿Qué podemos hacer para mejorar su experiencia con nosotros o algo así? Porque como es un producto, no es un servicio. No sé si tiene que ver. Mm -hmm. let, let me read it. Es que, es que lo veo muy pequeñito, no sé por qué no. Hello, me... hello, I need. To the found, the found, the product is very bad one. Okay, sería así, miren. Hello, eh, I am calling because eh, I need a refund. I bought a product and it, I'm not satisfied with, with it. The product is very bad or is a bad one. I'm oh, sorry to one. hear that. And, um, and you can offer a reform or you can offer a change of product. Uh -huh. Es que es king. No, no, es, no puede ser cool, ¿verdad, teacher? Sí, lo podemos, lo puede ser así. We could, could, could we offer you? Así puede ser. We could. ¿Cómo se dice solucionar? Solve. Solve. Ajá. Entonces se puede poner How we could solve your problem. Exactly. Very good. How could we How could we solve uh -huh, your problem? Eh... Eh, ahí te has equivocado en el we el we iría después de how oh, cool. ajá how no I, how could we no 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 estaba bien how could we ajá porque es una pregunta cuando es pregunta siempre va el how primero luego el could y luego el we Mm, okay. So your how could we solve your problem? How could we resolve your problem? Exactly. Change the product. Change the product. I need me. Ah. 
Ahí oh. hey, hey, estás enojado y... <risa> Ey, cuando vos te, te sale ah, algo malo, no, vos no dejas hablar bonito. No, hombre, para nada. De un, ahí, de, de un solo le vas poniendo. Cabal. <risa> Cámbiame el producto o devuélveme el dinero. Eh. Ok. No, pero es, es, es risible porque ahorita estoy recordándome que cuando a veces te toca, eh, me toca pedir cosas y a veces a los chinos. Oh. And, and then I say you, uh, did, you did you report the problems? Mm -hmm. come, come. Did, did you report? Did you report the problems? The problem. No, yo, 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 You can say that, yes, I did, but I didn't have any response. Pues, en front of it, ninguna respuesta, or I didn't get a solution to my problem, or something like that. Okay, okay, okay. You are complaining. Entonces, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Entonces, and say you respond me, yes, I did, but I didn't, I didn't, um, I, did get get I didn't get a solution. I did. Yeah, yeah. Yes, I did. Yeah, but solution I didn't get. I didn't. Yes. Uh -huh. I didn't receive any solution to my problem. Exactly. My problem. And then, and then, and then, and then, and then, and then, no, voy a, yo le voy a, le voy a plantear, me voy a volver más pesimista y como se supone que yo he estado te esperando. te vas a arreglar, que, cámbiate de compañía. We, we have, no, we, we may, Ajá. we may, we may have Ajá. many, Many problems uh -huh. with my uh -huh. with all or business. Uh -huh. What business? ¿Cómo se escribe business? C U double S. -S. Yes, yes. yes. I N E. Mm? S, S. W, S. Yes. Ok. Ok. En yo digo, we may have many problems with our business. Entonces, de seguro tendremos problemas con nuestros negocios. Porque no nos estamos comunicando, ¿verdad? It's only one S at the beginning. I, I wrote it here in the, in the chat, ¿ok? Ok. <sighs> Christine. Yes. Ok. Y usted me dice, yes. ¿Cómo hacemos? <laughs> Ajá, entonces me dice usted, how do you make it? How do, how we. Es de mala calidad este producto. Ajá. This bell has poor quality. Ahí usted me dice que podría revisarlo con el supervisor. I could go. You may, 
Hola. Hello, teacher. No, no, continue, continue. Hello, Nancy. Eh, teacher. Hello, teacher. Este, el producto estamos viendo con, con Rocío, que es una conversación donde nosotros eh, damos a demostrar lo, el, lo malo que es el producto. Uh -huh. Como usted había puesto una, unos ejemplos por ahí, que estaba insatisfecho, que es de mala calidad, y todo eso, ¿verdad? Exactly. Poor quality. Mm -hmm. It's okay. Entonces, yo le digo, este Rocío. Ajá. Eh, es de mala calidad del producto. Que solo lo podría ver con, con el gerente. Ajá. Something else you need? Please let me know. Hello, teacher. Hello. Okay. How is it going? Don't need. Good show. Merci. You. Something else you need, please me. let me know. Después, eh, le gustó el servicio, si sería. Mm -hmm, yeah, we will, we can ask. I will ask you, um, how was your, your food? Do you like it or do you like to make a, a recommendation uh, for a what, restaurant? What do you think about the attention? The, attention. the service. Or service. The service. Are you satisfied with the service? You are satisfied. How satisfied are you this product or, or use this service by Syria? Uh -huh. Are you satisfied with With my service, puede ser porque yo le serví como mes, uh -huh. la mesera, ¿verdad? Ajá. Uh -huh. Are you service. satisfied with my service? Eh, eh, usted diría, yes, uh, uh, excellent, you service. Thank you so much. Excellent service sería su respuesta, ok. Mm -hmm. Excellent service. Uh, al final también pueden decir any suggestion to improve, improve our service. Alguna sugerencia ah, pues para sí. mejorar. Do you have any, any suggestion or any recommendation improve. for improving the service? Do you have any suggestions or recommendation for improving the service? I see, see I, I, uh, my recommendations, Noah. Ah, uh, si tiene alguna recomendación, yes, puede decir, uh -huh. I recommend, no sé, qué es lo que quiere recomendar. No. I recommend, I may recommend. Uh -huh. I may recommend. Marcos, ¿qué puede decir Marcos? Puede sugerir Marcos. <laughs> <laughs> ¿Qué sugiere? Ayudarle a, a Domingo, ¿qué es lo que opina? ¿Qué le gustaría sugerir? What do you like oh, to recommend? Okay. Maybe, maybe, maybe do better on the time of respuesta is request. Response, the time, the, the time of response. Mm -hmm. Time of response of the, the, give the menu. 
the main that... okay guys um you can um you can finish the the the, the conversation by your own because of the time we need to to go back to the main session right now. Yes, okay. Sure. We can come back to the main room. Yes. So how was it? Did you finish the conversation? Yes, teacher. Okay, that's good. We will have to present it tomorrow because of the time. Yes. Yeah, time flies. But you have more time to practice. Yes. To prepare. <laughs> mm -hmm. Good, very good. I need to take the last attendance, but we need to have all the people back in the session. Se ve divertida con sueño, teacher. <laughs> Thank you, Solo amiga. cara de que quiere planchar la oreja. <laughs> Dejo de planchar la oreja, teacher. Okay, so I uh, think now, yeah, the majority is here. Uh, we are going to take the attendance. I'm going to take the last attendance. So let me see. Alba Vides. Alfredo Alexander. Present teacher. Okay, good. Um, Amilcar Cañengues. Press. Press. <laughs> okay. Carlos Gualberto Rodriguez. Present teacher. Cristina Romero. Present teacher. Domingo Alexander. Present teacher. Thank you. Fátima Portillo. Present. Pat, eh, José Matías Lemos. I'm here. Thank you. Marco David. Present teacher. Eh, Marlon Cardona. Oh, okay. Um, Mauricio Mahana. Present teacher. Thank you. My Deli Yudi. Nancy Rodriguez. Present teacher. Okay. Rocio Maritza. Rocio Martinez. Present teacher. Salvador Escobar. Present teacher. Um, Sandra Velázquez. Present teacher. Uh, Victor Salazar. Present. Walter Daniel González. William Eduardo Pérez. Jasmine Melanie Lemos. Present teacher. Okay, good. Okay, guys, I know that um, eh, we couldn't finish, eh, I mean, to present the, the conversations in front of the class right now, but I hope that we can do it tomorrow. So you have more time to practice, to finish it, to improve it and tomorrow we are gonna have it, okay, in the class. Now, um, I just want to remind you that it, this is a video conference number eight. So very soon I will be checking the homework, number two. So please, um, I suggest you to 
continue working, okay, in the homework, in the assignments that you have after every class. And then you will, you will have all of them by Wednesday, okay? Another thing is that I sometimes, uh, that I post, I post a, a, a question or exercises in the, in the forum. So you can also uh, add your comments or your answers, okay? In the forum discussion. So thank you so much and see you tomorrow. Have a good night. Good night. Good night. Have a beautiful Good night. night. Have a beautiful Good night. night. Good night. You Bye. too. Bye. Good night, teacher. Good, Good night. night. Matias. Yes. Hi, me. <laughs> so you are staying. See you tomorrow, teacher. See you all tomorrow, Nancy. Have a good night. Take care. Rest. Okay, Matias. Okay. How are you? Well. Very well. Wow, today you were a little bit quiet. Ando rendido, teacher. Hoy fue un día difícil. I am tired. Muy difícil. Tell me about it, but in English. Try to say it in English, okay? My day is difficult. Your day was difficult. Yes. Can you tell me why? Mm. Okay. And in the morning, pretty hi, I am pretty, no, I, I pretty, I print. I yes. printed? I print. I print. Mm -hmm. Ah, sí, print. ¿Cómo se dice un fondo? O sea, en la mañana imprimí un fondo. A background. Background, okay, background. Uh, print a uh, background and good paper. Mucho. You did a lot of things. And... También. Also? Also, I say also, okay, also. Um, cambié la cuchilla de la guillotina. No sé cómo es. Cambiar, change. Ajá, I changed. Change, I change. Cuchilla. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let me look for that. Because cuchilla is mm -hmm. nice, but it's different. Nice, it's nice. Uh -huh. My and the the machine with K when es que when verdad que corta papel que cut paper only that ah aquí está blade esa era la que andaba buscando so you change the blade 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 mm -hmm. ah igual que espada no, es war, espada, ¿verdad? Swar. Swar. Ah, swar. Ajá, pero also, but also uh -huh. blade. Cuchilla. Ah, uh, uh, blade. En general. Uh, cuchilla, blade. Uh -huh. Ah, sí, es blade. Ah, pues sí, chain, blade, machine. Ok. Uh -huh. eh, also, in the meeting, uh, with my boss uh, because uh, one problem uh, with one work con un trabajo and mm -hmm. uh, uh, also is not my problem no it's my problem 
It's not your problem. problem. It's not your. It's not your shame. I mean, your fault. It's not your fault. No, it's your fault. Mm -hmm. It's not your fault. Ah, okay. No, you. No. No, no, my... no. It's not your fault. fault. Ah, fault. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, only that. Ah. And um, the finish my work. In driving in my motorcycle and abajo de la tormenta. Oh, <laughs> under the rain. <laughs> and under the rain, yes, it's very hard. The, you got wet? <laughs> yeah, no. No, you didn't no, get wet? No, no. It, Solo mi casco. Oh, your helmet. Yeah, helmet. Did you wear a helmet. special, um, a special clothes sí te... for the storm? Eh, sí, pero like a... no, no la llevé. Okay. You didn't bring it today. In, 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 in my house. It wasn't at home. Yeah, sí. that usually happens. Mm -hmm. I had a very tiring day today also, a lot of work. Um, yeah, but the thing is that even though I could say congratulations, Matias, because even though you had a bad day, you were in the class because okay. you are very responsible and that's good. Yes, thank you. Fisher. Uh, how do you do in your work? Um, what do I do, or how do you, or how do I do? <laughs> when? ¿Qué hace? What do you do? What do you do? Uh -huh. I'm a teacher, also. <laughs> I also teach, but teenagers. Teenagers. Mm. And it's it, it's not online. It's uh, presential. Presential. Uh, mm -hmm. And you know, day. yes. So, todo el día. All day long, from eight to five. Oh. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. F o su trabajo, teacher. Why? No, I like it. Hey, I like teaching. Yes. Yeah, it's know. it's good because in the in the during the day I am with with teenagers and they are very active and they are very energetic. Ah, uh, sí. <laughs> yes, but it's good because um. Well, these guys are very intelligent and and they learn English very fast. And that's nice. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And yeah. at night, it's different because they have adults and you are very responsible and you have, you make a lot of questions and, and also you know a lot about different topics. So it's good because you make me think and I also learn, I am learning with you. That's my teaching philosophy. I think that when one person teaches, I mean, two are learning, the teacher mm. and the student. Because teachers, we don't know everything. We don't know everything. We are also learning with you. Mm. Mm -hmm. uh, and when, when, when you walk, where? When I, where? Where? Uh, where? Where? I okay, where? ask me the question again. Repeat the question, please. Okay. And uh, where? Where are Eva? Yes. Where are your work? Where? In the place. Work? It's um. It's here near the Stadium Magico Gonzalez. It's a um. A foundation, the Fundación Gloria de Cris. Mm, 
Mm -hmm. So it's like a, a school, oh yeah, it's a school center for talented students mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. that are, they don't have a lot of money, right? Talented students who, I mean, they, they give these opportunities to, to the students, to these students, they help them with their studies and mm -hmm. also to go to the university. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Driving car or on the bus? Do you drive a car or do you take the bus? Ask me the question. Okay. And do you drive a car do, or do you drive a bus? No, do you take a bus? Iba a tomar, okay. Yeah, do because I take... don't drive a bus. <laughs> 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 or a okay. coaster. Well, by the moment, um, I sometimes take the bus, and mm -hmm. I sometimes uh, I I well, when I go to work, uh, my cousin my cousin takes me to work. Mm -hmm. But when I come back, sometimes I take the bus, or sometimes my my boyfriend uh, picks me up. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah, yeah so right now I don't have a car, but I hope to have it soon. <laughs> <laughs> Pronto. Yeah. Soon, very soon. I hope so. Very soon. Okay, very soon. I am saving. I am saving. It's because I don't like debts. I hate debts. So I prefer to save the money and then buy the things that I want. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, teach. Now I would like to I would like you to tell me or to talk to me about your son. Yes. <laughs> Do you live with him? Do you live with your son? Ah. Mm, I am live only my one son. And my old son live in, in uh, Escalón. Okay. Yes. So you live, uh, you live with your son. Okay, mm -hmm. with, with the, the little one. The little one, yes. Okay, On good. Very good. Yes. Okay, Matias. Um, just a recommendation. When you talk, remember this structure in English. In English, okay. we have. Ay, no sé por qué no me da el chat. Aquí está. Okay. But in English, hay una estructura. Mire. A structure sí. of sentences. En inglés es muy diferente al español. En el español le damos vuelta, ¿verdad? Y al final nos damos a entender. Pero en inglés hay una estructura que ya está. Y siempre va a ser así. Subject. Subject. Verb. And complement. Ajá. Entonces, cuando usted vaya a decir algo, acuérdese de que primero va... Subject, después el verbo que puede ser en pasado, futuro, presente o como sea, y luego el complement, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Ahora, cuando es pregunta, cuando es pregunta en español, no usamos verbos auxiliares, ¿verdad? Para hacer preguntas, solo preguntamos ya. Uh -huh. El verbo de un solo, ¿verdad? Lo hacemos en futuro, pasado, como sea. Pero en inglés tenemos que utilizar un auxiliar. Entonces sería primero el auxiliar. Para hacer preguntas siempre. Para hacer preguntas, ajá, el verbo. Auxiliar, the auxiliary verb or modal verb. Mm -hmm. Auxiliary verb. And then we have the subject. Luego el verb in base form. And Dependiendo del... Uh -huh. Y de ahí el complemento. 
And then the complement, exactly. ¿Qué le parece si hace unas, unas oraciones? Me hace cinco oraciones y cinco preguntas. Y me las manda al chat, eh, al, al WhatsApp. Pueden ser de cualquier tipo, ¿ok? Del presente, del pasado, del futuro. Solo es para chequear cómo está, ¿ok? Ok. Ok, Matías, we have to finish. Ok, teacher. Okay, teacher. But it was good to have this session with you, ¿ok? Ok, have a beautiful night, teacher. You too, good night. Good night.